Hello and welcome. My name is Ben Jenkins and I'm a Senior Solutions Engineer here at Datto. Today, we're going to run you through the Datto Partner Portal and specifically how this can help you manage your fleet of BCDR devices to save you time and ultimately money. As you can see, we're at the home screen of our Datto Partner Portal. The Datto Partner Portal allows you to manage your Datto products, gather information about the rest of the Datto product suite, run pre-made marketing campaigns, and also complete courses inside of the Datto Academy to fully understand these Datto solutions. Today, we're going to be focusing on the BCDR appliance management. We can access this by clicking on the status tab on the top left of the page and then selecting BCDR status. You will notice that there are status pages to manage other products as well. And you can learn more about these in their own separate videos. Once BCDR status has loaded, we'll be able to see all of the Datto devices that we are able to manage. Starting at the top of the screen, we can change our view to suit our needs and personal preferences. We are also able to change how we are sorting these devices, as well as hiding or showing certain types of devices. Going down from there, we can focus on the devices themselves. And today, we're going to be focusing on DVLB Cirrus. Over to the right of the device name, I can click on the device web icon and get a remote connection to this device from anywhere in the world. This enables you to manage this device without needing to be on site or connecting to the customer site for a VPN. While this may seem like it doesn't save a lot of time on a customer to customer basis, Overall, it can really add up. To the right from there, we can see the model of the device followed by the client. Following up is the last check-in. By default, Datto devices check in every 10 minutes, and this gives you a nice idea when the device last spoke to the Datto cloud. Finally, we can see the amount of tickets currently open, the amount of data in the Datto cloud, and then the amount of used space on this device. Clicking on the device name opens up the device details page. This device details page allows you to have a deeper view into the device. And on this page, we can see pieces of information like the hardware and software status of the device, as well as what data center the device is sending data to. Finally, right at the top, we can set the device alerts from here, telling you if the device is storing X amount of data or if the device has been offline for longer than X amount of time. All of this can be configured. Jumping back to the previous screen, you can see on the left, we have a list of the agents that we're currently protecting. These are machines that the Datto solution is or has backed up to the on-premise appliance. Over to the right of here, we can see if any of these machines have any drives that are not currently protected, allowing us to make sure that we have got total data protection. Next is the latest screenshot. And this is where you can see one of the key technologies that the Datto solution is based upon, testing your backups. Using screenshot verification, you are able to automatically test your backups to prove that they are bootable on a Datto solution and this is then shown straight away on the Datto Partner Portal. This allows you to check en masse that all of your client's machines are recoverable and protected. Over to the right of there, we can then see the last offsite sync, giving us a clean and easy understanding of when our data was last sent to the Datto Cloud. We can also see the last local backup, helping us understand when our last backup was taken Lastly, we can see our last 10 backup attempts, and the last 10 backup attempts can be very helpful in solving any issues that may be occurring at set times in the day, as well as giving us a clear overview of how successful your backups may have been. If I scroll down to a failed backup, I can see a big red cross, and when I hover over this big red cross, I can see this error message. This error message clearly tells me that the device cannot speak with the server, and I'm aware of this as the server is actually currently offline. The Datto Partner Portal is your single pane of glass to manage all Datto solutions 
easily and effectively. It's been built from the ground up to support our customers, helping them save time managing fleets, large or small. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to reach out to your local rep. Thanks.